Ranga, breaking news update coming in. This is source-based information that goes on to suggest that the MES confirmed Darshan Hiranandani signed his affidavit voluntarily in front of the designated officials of the consulate in Dubai. The letter has been sent to Ethics Committee of the Parliament. Remember, Mawa Moitra will be appearing before the Ethics Panel on the 2nd of November in the Cash for Query case. And in the latest, sources now are confirming that uh, Darshan Hiranandani had signed his affidavit voluntarily, something that has been maintained by Mawa Moitra and some in the TMC who go on to say that uh, Darshan Hiranandani perhaps was forced to sign the affidavit, the affidavit wherein he turned approver, wherein he spoke of uh, Mawa Moitra very much sharing her uh, parliament login details, login ID as well. All of those details have been accepted by Darshan Hiranandani in this affidavit and now sources suggesting that the MES confirmed that Darshan Hiranandani signed his affidavit voluntarily in front of designated officials of the consulate in Dubai. Let me go across to Pragya joining us live with more details. The letter has been sent to the Ethics Committee of the Parliament as well, but this most certainly ensures that all of those claims and refusals coming in from Mawa Moitra fall flat. Pragya. Absolutely, and this is very uh, significant in the wake of the fact that Mama Mitra said that a gun was put to her darshan Hiran and Dani's head. In fact, and he was pressurized to write all of that that he had written in the sworn document. First, there were questions on the document which was not attested and notarized. Then, uh, when the notarized document came, uh, Mahua Mitra said that, uh, you know, he has been pressurized in saying all of that. So, uh, Ethics Committee, in fact, had written to MEA uh, in the first meeting that it held, uh, and they had asked for a notarized version and also an affidavit that uh, this was a voluntary. In fact, under the Apostle Convention uh, 1961, this document was, uh, in fact, uh, there is a, uh, a process of how to legalize a document in one of the contract states and this is uh, what has been done it has been done in Dubai and this was now the ethics committee has received this letter from MEA that it was done voluntarily uh, by Darshan Hiranandani himself so there is no question of pressurizing him by anyone in fact not by the government in fact there were allegations on uh, Mahua Mitra as well leveled by uh, BJP MP Nishikan Dubey when he said that Mahua Mitra is in touch with Darshan Hiranandani and it is she who is pressurizing Darshan to uh, you know say uh, things other than uh, that he, he had written in sworn affidavit and there are many incriminating evidence in that sworn affidavit uh, you know the, the affidavit that he has given uh, there are charges of uh, sharing the member ID login log, uh, log some credentials with him which is very incriminating in nature because uh, the BJP MP and the complainant has said that this has everything to do with national security. Uh, Lok Sabha uh, site has uh, very sensitive data information and possibly classified information that has impact on the policy that the nation makes. And this can be expo exploited by any unauthorized access, not just that. The affidavit also says that Mahua Mitra also, uh, you know, pressurized him in giving gifts and everything that she was very depending of the time as well. So all these events, you know, if uh, she is uh, summoned for November 2nd and uh, she has to appear before the ethics committee then, if she goes there, this evidence is one of uh, uh, the very important piece of fact that may go against her okay. even when she, was, uh, she is going to be cross-examined by the members of the ethics panel. All right. Uh, remember already the BJP.